Good morning. This is Kate Green with your Divine Reading. Today is Wednesday. The first card I pull is the Three of Swords. And it says, Heartbreak is hard enough. Hold it on to those emotions make it worse. Let this card remind you to write out your feelings. Then let them go with love. You are in charge of your own happiness. No time like now to clear your heart of unwanted visitors. You may be feeling helpless and hopeless. So it's time to let go. Facing your fears. Look for ways to strengthen your connection to the universe and others. Stay peaceful and calm in the knowing of who you are. Sister Cups. Old friends bring you happiness today. Revisit those places that bring back memories of happy times together. Recapture the simple joys of your discovered in childhood. The energy now is geared towards pleasant times and fun friends. Make time to the, today to remind someone why they are in your life. Dreams coming true. Manifesting. Let your personality shine. You have something no one else has that makes you makes you who you are. Stop comparing yourself to others and allow your uniqueness to shine through. Judgment. You are approaching a significant moment in your life which may come with the bells of a major life happening. Or it may be a quiet rise to the next great thing. Celebrate, transcend it, and enjoy the ride. Next stop will be the beginning of your new stairway upward. Mastering. Mastering yourself, mastering your gifts. Take note. Your answers are being given to you. Quieting external voices and excessive noise We give you the chance to hear what is being offered. King of Pentacles. Reap the benefits of hard work. There may be a lack of direction around you. Pick up the tools you need to do the work. Your zeal for control could be Stimulating, stumbling, could be a stumbling block. Generosity pays for itself. Sweat equi- equi- yeah. equity works better than a cash handout. Lead by doing. Teach. Teaching others. Being a role model. Amber with contentment. Waiting rather than acting is going to be the most advantage now. Caterpillar opportunity. Transformation opportunity. Independence from conditioned responses. The energy of the caterpillar appears heralding a time of transformation and opportunity. Here you are being asked to revise your dreams. If it looks like and smells familiar, step away from it for the time being. The new cannot emerge from the old, and the youthful and vital cannot emerge with the aged and sickly. Experiment and surprise yourself with what arises for you in this moment. Caterpillar is an invitation to rest, to test out a new strategy to get a different, better result. Remember that the definition of lunacy is continuing with the same thinking and behavior and hoping for a different outcome. It's time to break away from the habitual responses to surprise yourself and startle others, eliciting a smile or a frown or look of awe from those around you. 
Do not wait for an invitation from life up to practice a bit of outrageousness or for permission to do the unexpected. Any other response right now will lead more of the same and no real change. Sometimes the most original response is no response whatsoever. Stand stock still, staring steadily into the eyes of the players in your drama. Avoid engagement until the moment is right. Caterpillar invites you to witness the story unfolding, knowing that deciding on the timing of your action is essential as finding the best move to make. And when you do act, let there be no doubt in anyone's mind of your determination and the power you unleash. Pillar of Light <clears throat> Pillar of Light, burning bright, Earth star below, soul star above. Burn away all that is not light, transform all into unconditional love. Star of Isis to sin, your blessings peace without end. Grace me now with peace and protection, completely embraced by divine pr protection. And that is your reading for today. I am love. We are love. Thank you for watching.